guys welcome to my channel I want to apologize first um, this is a very spontaneous video and um, sorry and uh, so I'm sorry if it's gonna be like a little bit of this a little bit of that sorry for that today I want to talk about why I'm not a minimalist or why I'm not a typical minimalist stay tuned and enjoy So basically, uh, we are all different and everybody takes their own way as they want and as they like. And same here. Um, I am not saying that I am a typical minimalist and that's why I do not want to get labeled. I still have a lot of stuff. I am decluttering I am getting rid of stuff but there our apartment is still full of things I mean you can not change everything overnight right everybody takes their own minimalist journey as they want and as they like um, for everybody minimalism means something different for one it could be living in a white clear apartment for someone else it could be traveling around the world with just a single backpack. For me, there is no specific definition of minimalism. It means to be surrounded by things that uh, bring me happiness and fulfillment. On the other side, it also means getting rid of stuff that is decluttering me, my life, our apartment, and I know that this is a long way journey and a long way process and um, I am still exploring and learning new things. As I said, you cannot change everything overnight, like it's impossible. And I personally think that we should not get rid of stuff that we love and that makes us happy. But that's just my personal opinion. I know that people think that minimalists uh, minimize their uh, stuff just to basics. We all are different and every minimalist is different and for all of the minimalist, minimalism means something different. Another thing is um, I am a vegan and I think that a lot of vegans are minimalists and a lot of minimalists are vegan. And um, the both sides uh, consume less, they buy less, and that means that their eco footprint is lighter. On the other side, I think that the most uh, significant way of reducing our eco footprint is eliminating our consumption, consumption of uh, animal based products. Minimalists and vegans try to reduce the impact on our planet. I see there kind of a connection between minimalists and vegans um, because as I said we buy less, we use less, we need less. Minimalism and veganism go kind of hand in hand. Through minimalism I have learned that buying stuff doesn't necessarily make you happy. That's why I started to declutter, I started to get rid of things and all the things that we have not been using for ages. Of course decluttering is not easy and was not easy at all because uh, especially for someone like me that I was buying stuff like crazy. I admit that I still have to learn a lot of things. Also, um, through minimalism, I have learned the value of things and the value of money. I don't know if I mentioned, but I have been unemployed for 10 months now. And um, I haven't been buying stuff, obviously. 
I also have learned that I do not necessarily need a lot of things that I would have bought if I had the money. I have definitely learned the value of things and the value of money. For me the important thing is um, that I am on my way to focus on what is important to me, what brings me happiness and fulfillment. This goes kind of hand in hand with setting priorities. Through setting priorities I have started um, to concentrate myself on things that I love and that make me happy. I also started to use my time more wisely because as I said I concentrate myself only on things or on doing things that I love. I am still on this journey, I am still on my way and I am so excited where this journey is gonna take me. I am so interested and I want to know everything. So now I want to know about you and your experience. If you want to know more about this topic, make sure you read my blog post. I will put the link down in the description box. If you want to be friends with me, go and check my Instagram. For more videos, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and I hope I will see you at the next video very soon. Bye!